My name is Garrett Snyder. I'm the food editor at LA Weekly, and I graduated from LMU in 2010 with a degree in screenwriting. And the best thing about being a food critic in Los Angeles is definitely the kind of hidden gems we have. Um, a lot, I mean, there's a lot of great food in the city, obviously, but the most thrilling part is when you come, you eat something that you haven't even rem tried anything remotely like it before, or you go somewhere you haven't heard of at all, and it's a complete surprise. And because the city is so spread out and so diverse and so just riddled with awesome places to eat, you know, it, every place can be a surprise. And I, I think in a lot of cities, you know, that's not always the, the case because they're not as kind of, um, you know, clustered out in the way LA is. Uh, one of my favorite places to eat in LA is uh, called Rice Bar. And it's this place that's in downtown Los Angeles. It's like a former fine dining chef who kind of left working for the Patina Group, which is a lot of, kind of a high-end restaurant. Um, and he opened this really small, intimate, like, you know, 10 seat, um, kind of restaurant um, where you can go and get these beautiful Filipino inspired rice bowls um, and he makes all the stuff in the kitchen in this really tiny space um, beautiful sweet spicy sausage called longanisa is one of the bowls um, with garlic fried rice and he uses these really interesting kind of heirloom varieties of rice that come from the Philippines and you know just these like uh, really nuanced balanced food but it's also like aggressive street food Little Jewel of New Orleans is also one of my favorite places to eat. Um, it's, so I used to go there a lot when I was living in Chinatown. Um, basically, it's like this uh, guy, a chef from, um, he's from New Orleans, he's been living out in LA, and he just wanted to kind of reopen this deli that served the foods he grew up with in New Orleans. So the kind of specialty, I guess, is these massive po' boys. I mean, like, they're huge. They could easily feed two. Um, and you know he does like all these kind of authentic combinations. The bread's right, and you know, all these things that people from New Orleans complain about, he kind of gets right. Um, and the, I mean, my favorite is definitely these like the, the combination of like roast beef, which is this really kind of stewed down, uh, dense, tender roast beef that he just kind of ladles on with all the meaty gravy, and then on top of it is uh, um, you know the little cornmeal battered shrimp. And just a little bit of the remoulade, the kind of mayo sauce on top, and some you know pickles, and it's like a, a really awesome sandwich. Maurice Coast Jalisco is probably one of my favorite places to eat in Los Angeles. Um, it's a food truck that I just found out about actually. I think reading uh, Jonathan Gold, who's one of my favorite food writers in LA, and a, you know huge inspiration to what I do. It, it specializes in mariscos, like seafood. Um, so the item that I'm really fascinated with. Um, is called the Posada and Tostada. A tostada that's loaded with, um, I think it's uh, agua chile, which is like this really spicy marinated raw shrimp. Um, it's got some uh, other, some fish ceviche on it. It's got some octopus. It's got, you know, a bunch of uh, avocado loaded on top and it's just kind of like covered in salsa. It's this massive, very messy tostada that you just kind of like dig into, squeeze some lime over it and just like, you know, it's, it's amazing. I mean, it's really fresh, beautiful seafood. The salsas they make there, it's amazing. And yeah, it's a cheap lunch too, you know? One thing I wish people understood about the LA food scene is just that, you know, it really extends beyond places like Venice or West Hollywood, Beverly Hills. I mean, there's so much out there. And I think that, you know, uh, be open to uh, good food in unexpected places, not judging a book by its cover. Uh, that's, that's a great advice to have. Taco stands. Fries or onion rings? Fries. Alfredo or marinara? Marinara. Lo mein or banh mi? Ooh, banh mi. Breakfast or lunch? Mm, lunch. Drinks or dinner? Dinner. Red or white? White. Latte or Americano? Uh, latte. Beard or Michelin? Mm, beard, definitely. Chopped or chow mein? Chow hounds. Guy or Bobby? Ooh, <laughs> Bobby. Jonathan Gold or Michael Pollan? Jonathan Gold. East side or West side? East side. Venice or Silver Lake? Mmm, Silver Lake. El Coyote or Luis? Ooh. That's a tough one. Uh, <laughs> let's say El Coyote. Langers or Cantors? Oh, Langers. In and out or Dodger Dogs? In and out. Alejos. California Pizza Kitchen or your kitchen? My kitchen. Valera or Rossi? 
Roski. <laughs>